I really hope you enjoyed that little intro, but as you probably have already guessed, I want to show you another hidden input device today. You have to throw a item onto a path block in order to activate it. And you even get your item dispensed back at you. Then whatever redstone contraption you have hooked up to the input device gets triggered. For this example I have a piston right here that pulls and pushes the start up and down. Now let's check out the redstone behind this contraption. As you can see the redstone is very compact just coming in at 6 blocks volume without the ground and 9 blocks volume including the ground up here. If you didn't know, hoppers can pick up items through paths, soul sand and similar. This is what the hopper below the path does and to get the items back up to you we shoot it through the ground with a dropper that you can see right here. We activate that dropper with this observer chain which detects a change in this comparator's output which is going to change when a item is passing through the hopper and into the dropper which is going to activate it. Our output is the comparator or the observer chain but you will get two signals from the observer chain and only one from the comparator. Well, I hope you have enjoyed that short video and if you did, make sure to write and comment. If you want to watch more great redstone, you can check out my other projects. Anyway, I hope to see you all next time.